A Supreme Court ruling has been issued that will allow members of the homeless population to be ticketed for sleeping and camping outside on public property. Brianna Malone joins us in the studio with reaction from a local advocate tonight. Brianna. That's right, Jen. The executive director of the Upper Room says this is a time for conversations to take place to advocate for those who need housing. The Supreme Court ruled on Friday in favor of an Oregon city that ticketed homeless people for sleeping or camping outside. The executive director of the Upper Room says it is not clear where the ruling will go into effect, but considers this an opportunity to raise awareness for the situation at hand. This is actually an opportunity for our community and all communities to actually uh, get more involved with the affordable housing for homeless individuals and supportive services. McLaurin says this is the time for state and federal government to become involved and find a solution to end homelessness. He says there are options available for those who need it should a situation arise. They can uh, call uh, shelter services in, in Erie County obviously and they can come here. Um, we have people here that can help try to advocate for them to get them into a place or, or, or find somewhere they can go that, where they're not on the street. The executive director of the Mercy Center for Women calls the ruling unfair and says it only leaves two options for those who are homeless. Even if an individual is sleeping with a blanket on a bench, um, they will be fined or perhaps uh, do jail time. So they have two choices. They can either stay awake um, or spend time in jail. In order to combat this in our region, Haggerty says our local leaders need to band together and make homelessness a priority. I ask them or invite them uh, to be a part of the boots on the ground effort in getting to know why somebody's homeless. So why not talk to that population, that demographic, do their homework, and then um, work together to see how we can perhaps not completely solve it, but make important moves so that everybody has a house. Haggerty says it is important to remember that it is someone's choice on if they want to be housed or not. Sean. Brianna Malone reporting tonight.